today I'm here with a new video and today I'm doing like a wish list but I'm doing a Black Friday wish list. Black Friday is soon happening and I want to show you some things that I might pick up on Black Friday. I don't know how much I'm going to shop. I have no freaking idea. I know one thing that I will buy during Black Friday. I will talk about that a little bit later but I'm going to tell you about some things that I really want to buy and I might buy it on Black Friday if it is a good price. So I will scooch a little bit because I will put up pictures here. I hate when I have to do that but it's the best. And okay, what should I start with? Um, okay, one thing. <laughs> I can start with a thing that I know I'm going to pick up. It is the Oriental Express from Nomad Cosmetics. And I saw on their Instagram like their schedule for Black Friday, what kind of prices they're going to have and stuff like that. And which discounts and the Oriental Express is going to be 50% off. I can leave, I think I will put in the picture with the Black Friday schedule thing. Um, it will be 50% off and I will of course buy it then because I really want that palette. So I'm going to buy it when it's 50% off. So that is one thing that I am 99% sure that I'm going to buy. The Oriental Express from Nobed Cosmetics. Okay, next up. This I also think I am going to buy. I don't know if this is going to be any like black friday price on it or not and i think i will buy it either way and it is the new blushes from lethal cosmetics the these these look amazing and now i'm going to or i can take it later exciting uh yeah i'm going to buy some of these blushes if they don't have like a special black friday price i'm just going to buy them either way i don't know how many Maybe just one or two, I don't know, or I will buy three and fill up a palette. I have no idea, but I want to test them out and I'm going to do it. I'm just going to wait and see if there is any offers on Black Friday, but I'm absolutely checking these out and I'm so waiting for Annette to do a video with these because I just want to see them like in action. So yeah. The blushes from Lethal Cosmetics. And then one thing that is going to like... I don't know about this, but... The Beetlejuice collection from Melt. I really, really want it. I think I want to buy it all. But... It's not coming to Beauty Bay. Not the whole like PR collection. Thing. It's coming some things to... I don't know if maybe everything's coming to Beauty Bay, but it's not going to be like a set that you can buy. But you can buy the set from Melt's own website. And now I want to tell you one thing. If you watch a lot of Swedish, like YouTubers, I'm just going to check one thing on my phone. If you watch a lot of Swedish YouTubers that are doing videos in English and you hear them talk a lot about how expensive it is to get things to Sweden from the US, I'm going to make an example now. And this is... <laughs> I think it is, it's, it is insane. But okay, if you're playing with the thing that this melt PR box is going to cost $300. I don't know if it's going to be that, but I talked a little bit to Debbie and she said that the last year's holiday collection was $300, the PR kit, and if we're just playing with the thought that it's going to be $300. To get it to Sweden, and now I'm not talking about the shipping from melt, I think it's free over $100, uh, but this if I'm going to buy this kit for $300 to get it to Sweden with buying, with paying all the taxes and fees and everything, I will pay in total around $460. Do you see the problem with how much taxes and stuff we have to pay in Sweden? 
it's like 50% of the price we have to pay in customs and fees and everything. So I don't know if I'm going to buy this PR kit. I want it, but that is insanely much money. I just wanted to get it out there because I know that y you probably don't know how much it cost. And uh, yeah, so if you ever heard a Swede complain about the high cost to get things from the US to Sweden, now you know why. And now you know how high it is. But yeah, I really want this, but we will see. <laughs> Maybe I just change my mind and buy the palettes. But I really want this. I have been loving the movie Beetlejuice since I was... I don't even know how old I was when I first saw it. Around 10 maybe? I've seen it a lot of times and I love it. It's one of my absolute favorite movies. So I'm going to buy at least the palettes. I don't know about the PR kit because... I don't know if I want to spend so much money on it. And okay. What do I want more? Yeah. I also want to buy something from Divina and I think they usually have some Black Friday sale but it's the same thing with Divina. It's going to cost me so so much money to get it here and I might pick something up. I don't know. They have pretty high shipping or at least they had it before but I really would love to try Divina and I might order some together with some of my friends in Sweden. We usually do it because it is cheaper that way. But yeah, I really want to try something from Divina and if it's a really really good Black Friday sale, I might finally pull the trigger. It feels like I've talked about Divina for... I don't even want to know how long. But <laughs> I would love to try Divina. Then another thing. I haven't... I think I want this, but I'm not sure. And I know that this brand usually have a really good Black Friday prices and that I bought from them last Black Friday last year and it's Black Moon Cosmetics. I can't decide if I want to buy the Urban Myth palette. I really love how it looks but I don't know if I'm going to use it that much. But I really love that it's like a matte green and then a shimmer green, a matte blue and a shimmer blue and like that. And I don't know. And I really like the front of the palette and I think that Black Moon Cosmetics, like how they do the packaging and everything, it really appeals to me. I think that's the right word. I have like... I don't know what I'm talking about. And if I'm going to buy this, I think I will try some of their lipsticks. Because I've heard so, so good things about their liquid lipsticks. And you know me. I love me a good red lipstick, a liquid lipstick. But I would buy a red one. So, I might pick up some liquid lipsticks from Black Moon Cosmetics. I might pick up the Urban Myth palette. I don't know. Everything has to be like, how much money do I want to spend on Black Friday? I have no idea. What do I thinking about more? Yeah, I also... <sighs> thinking about buying the new Nabla palette. They usually have really good prices on Black Friday. And Nabla is also available on Beauty Bay. And Beauty Bay also usually have a good Black Friday sale and this I don't side by side collection I don't like even know I think the palette is called side by side and they also released side by side new palette and they also released a little quad with glitters like the Miami lights but this is called Ruby lights glitter palette I don't know about the glitter palette, but like the side-by-side -side nude palette, it is something about it. It makes me want it, maybe because I have all the other palettes from Nobla, I don't know. I think though, I will watch some videos before, but if it is a really good price on this on Black Friday, I don't know if it will be because it's a new palette, but you never know. Nobla sometimes has really good offers and Nobla is a brand that is 
from Italy and Italy and Sweden are both in uh, EU and they have like the sh fastest shipping ever. It usually goes faster for me from... They have super fast shipping inside of Europe, I think, uh, at least to Sweden, because one day I ordered on a Monday and I got it on Wednesday and that is like faster than if I order something inside of Sweden. Um, but yeah, if it is a good price on this, if I see some videos and people seem to love it, I think I will actually will buy it. I don't know how much I will use it, but I think I actually will buy it. And do you know what? I only think it's one more thing that I want to talk about and this isn't even makeup. Uh, this is ear weights and if you know me I got stretched ears and I love a store that is called Ask and Embla. I don't know how to say it. Ask and Embla that is like Swedish, old Swedish thing. <laughs> Mythology. I don't know what it's called. Oh, Satron, I have no idea. But Ask and Embla, and that's why I'm saying it in Swedish, because it's from Sweden from the beginning, like the name of it. Um, they have really cool ear weights, and they usually have good sales, and like even if it's not Black Friday, but I think I might pick some up. I actually have, I don't know how many of you are interested in this, but I know I got some questions sometimes about like, ear weights and piercings and stuff and I have I think it's two different ear weights from Ask and Embla I got I have these these are like dinosaur skulls I love these these I these I bought from Ask and Embla and I also have the one that I think is my absolute favorite it is these moons. I just love them. And they and they have some more that I really really want. So I might, if they have a good sale, pick some up because ear weights is just I love it so so much. And I think it's a way for me that have stretch ear to have like more fun like earrings. And yeah, I think that is all for my Black Friday wish list and things I might going to buy I mm, I don't want to say that I know that I'm going to buy but I want mostly the Beetle Use palettes from Melt and also the Oriental Express from Nomad and this feels like a little bit hard because I I, I okay are we going to talk about this I don't know am I stuck in something I am, um, I've talked a little bit about this before, I'm planning on doing maybe not a no buy but a low buy next year and <laughs> it feels sometimes like I am an addict to buying makeup because I'm like okay I'm just going to get one last like shopping spree and then I was like okay Black Friday is in November maybe I can shop 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 until I drop in November but at the same time I want to just take it a little bit easy, but we will see how much I will buy, how much of my hard-earned money I will spend. I don't know. But yeah, that's all. Is it something that you have your eyes on that you are going to buy or want to buy on Black Friday? Please let me know. I... It's like sometimes I think when... You live in Sweden and it is that high like taxes and shipping and customs fee and everything. It is like buying things on Black Friday. It's just like I'm going to pay the price that it is for like everybody else. But it's 50% off. But yeah, I don't know if you get what I mean. I don't even know if I get what I mean myself. But yeah. This was all for this video. I'm going to stop talk now because I don't want this to be so long. But yeah, I really hope you liked this video. And if you're not subscribing to my channel, please do. So you don't miss any of my videos. And I hope I will see you in the next one. Bye!